Hey guys, and welcome to an original Retry This Production. Today I'll be doing a Game Maker tutorial teaching you how to create movable crates in Game Maker. You can do this in Game Maker Lite or Pro, it doesn't matter. So, first thing you need to have is a crate sprite, which I have. I just used a 48 by 48 block, and I used the button eyes feature on the Game Maker sprite editor to make it. So, let's see, we'll create it into an object. Now I have two odd players. My green pl you cannot use H speed movement for this. You must use X movement. H speed movement will not work. So I modify my green player. So you need to have a keyboard left and a keyboard right event. Keyboard. In the keyboard left event, you, I just put X minus equal six. You don't have to worry about stuff above. Just X minus equal six. You cannot use H speed. H speed will not work. And for the keyboard right event, just use a key, X plus equal six. So you move it to the right. You don't have to worry about that stuff above. Just X plus equal six, or whatever the speed you want it to be. Release left and release right, both of them. Just X plus equal zero. For both of them, release key, key release left and key release right. Just put X plus equal zero. That's all you really need. That's all you really need. So okay. So I have Obi. Oh, I also forgot to mention that my player is solid. You don't. It doesn't matter. It'll still work regardless if your player is solid. Because I had to make him solid for a previous tutorial. So I just left. I'll just leave him like that. It doesn't matter if he's solid or not. Both of my players are solid, as you can see. So now. We'll go into our crate object. We want to make the crate solid and set the parent to the floor or wall object you have. So I have to go platformer, engine, terrain, obj underscore floor. And so now you want to add an event, a step, step event. Control, execute code. Now I'm going to copy and paste the gravity code because it's the gravity code. Everyone knows it. I don't feel like typing it, so I just copy that. So just put that in your code in your step of it. Now I'm gonna put the crate movement. Now, if place underscore meeting, we're gonna put we'll start off with the left movement. So we'll put X let's see. The, oh yeah, we're moving left, so you wanna put X plus six. So we're pushing the crate left. So we're gonna do X plus six. The player movement, the player speed is x minus equal six. So the speed it would be six. X plus six comma y comma obj underscore player. My player is called green player, so I'll just change that to green player. Next, you want to put a space and add and. You want to add and keyboard underscore check. Keyboard underscore check parentheses visual key or VK underscore left close parentheses bracket X minus equals six now a closing bracket this means we're pushing the crate to the left I'll just change this a little make it a little neater now we can just copy this, so we can just change the values. So we change this to minus six, change this to right, and we change this to plus. And now we're done. This is your basic crate movement. That's all you really need, and the gravity code. Works fine. So now let me show you what it looks like. So there's the crate, there's my player. Watch me push it. See, I'm pushing it fine. Crate movement. We Pushing a crate. So as I said, solid doesn't matter. So let me turn off solid. And let me show you what it, it's the same thing, doesn't matter.
that's just to clear the air for any stupid retards who would say it works better with solid screw this tutorial let's just shove it in their face so this has been an original you try this production i hope you enjoyed don't forget to subscribe we we